Donned in ISIS black, he confidently carries a long sniper rifle, a bandolier of ammunition. He picks off a tomato to show his skill. This is an ISIS video, and CNN has just learned this man trained on American soil. The fighter says he's Gulmurad Khalimov, a former commander in a special police counter-terror unit in Tajikistan, a key U.S. ally. From 2003 to 2008, I received specialized training in America on the military base of Blackwater. Blackwater. Blackwater, a controversial U.S. contracting company which sent private security personnel to Iraq and trained other countries' fighters at this compound in North Carolina. Contacted by CNN, Academy, the company that purchased Blackwater's training facility, was unable to confirm that Khalimov was there. The State Department tells CNN Khalimov participated in five counterterrorism courses in the U.S. and Tajikistan between 2003 and last year. We spoke with former Army sniper Paul Shari about what he might have learned. What skills that he would have learned do you think might hurt Allied forces on the battlefield? So the types of training that he's likely to have received would have been uh, basic tactics and maneuvers, the ability to, say, move through a building, move through an urban area in a tactical way, um, maybe basic marksmanship. Shari says U.S. contractors wouldn't have trained Khalimov to be a killing machine like Rambo. But if Khalimov was a top commander in Tajikistan's counter-terror forces, there's another worry. The real problem is he knows how to plan counter-terrorism operations. So he knows how the people who protect a high-value target will be thinking. He knows how the people who protect an embassy will be thinking. And so that puts him in a position to, as we would say in the military, to red team that, to, to think very intelligently out of it, how to disrupt those plans. That's a dangerous capability. Another ominous signal, Khalimov's threat against what he called American pigs. God willing, we will come to your cities, to your homes and we will kill you. The State Department says all appropriate vetting of Khalimov was done before he came to the U.S. Tajik officials have so far not commented on this man or this video. Khalimov has another dangerous skill that goes beyond what he can do with a sniper rifle. In this video, he speaks Russian. Analysts say that's a marketing decision by ISIS to use him as a tool to recruit more fighters from Central Asia. Wolf? Brian, he also claims to have been trained by the Russians as well, right? That's right. And another ominous skill, Wolf, he says he was trained by Spetsnaz. Those are elite Russian commando forces. So if he's got training from them and from U.S. Special Forces, he probably has considerable skill to use on the battlefield against the Allies and, of course, to train other ISIS fighters.